<laughs> These headlines are driven by the new Palmetto Ford Truck Super Center. Why buy your truck at a car store? Palmetto Ford. We know trucks, Panthers, Oilers. Game one cannot get here soon enough. It will be Saturday at Emirate Bank Arena. Right. <sighs> Just a reminder, game two is Monday, and then the series shifts back to Edmonton or shifts to Edmonton Thursday, Saturday. Those are you going to uh, bang the drum, Crowder, at the Panthers game? I see people, uh, they, they've been asking, like, who should bang the drum, what local celebrities. And uh, because I think it was uh, it was Usman for uh, yeah game six, right? Yeah. Um, have, have you been approached? I was asked first round. I remember I was, that. Yes. And I was out of town. But I don't know if I'm if my celebrity star shines bright enough for the for the for the Stanley Cup. Right. Yeah. You were asked in the he first was. round. He was yeah, the first he round. Was. He was they asked me, and I was I left town that I left town the night before, and I was out of town that day. Where were you, Minnesota skiing? I mean, you got a chance. <laughs> and to, who, to and, and who was it that night? Do you remember who it was? Raheem um, Mostert. Was it Mostert? Yeah. Upgrade. The night, yeah. The night that Mostert. <laughs> the night that Mostert. You know what? I actually agree with you. <laughs> It'd be great if you went up there to bang the drum and you just started spitting your teeth out. Every time you bang the drum, more teeth would fly out. Turn it into a bit. <laughs> oh, the guy that leads the NFL in rushing touchdowns are me. Yeah, they probably they probably upgraded, but he, yeah, but it was like Panthers fan two too. series yeah. ago. Yeah. Most true. He's a huge fan. Because I saw Mike McDaniel said, you know, they asked him yesterday, are you going to uh, be watching the Stanley Cup finals? And he's like, do I have a pulse? I'll be there. Uh, you weren't watching at Regatta uh, <laughs> on, on Saturday night, <laughs> Coach McDaniel, because I wasn't either, Jack. <laughs> they had a TV. Yeah, he was watching. <laughs> Who'd they have last year in the Stanley Cup finals? I, I vaguely remember Dan Marino bang the drum. Do I have that right? I feel me. like he did. I know uh, during these uh, these particular playoffs, uh, Goran Dragic has done it. Yeah, Usman, mm -hmm. like I said, there was one weird one. I can't remember who it is. It was like a, a very l a little known guy. Um, oh, I can't remember who it is. Man, but I, didn't Mike didn't Mike McDaniel do it? He's done it for sure. Yeah, he did it. I watched him. Christian uh, Christian Wilkins done it. I think a couple times. Yeah. Well, he was in he was in the box every game last season. He's well. a big Panthers fan, but now he can uh, kick rocks. Levon Hernandez did it. Levon Hernandez did it. That was cool. Yeah. Yeah. I love yeah. you, Sunrise. Yeah, that was great. <laughs> you know what? Christian Wilkins is kicking rocks to the Vegas Golden Knights. Well, that's what I'm saying. He can kick rocks. I mean, we we don't need that guy around here anymore. <laughs> <laughs> What a difference in whoever's traveling. Like Mike Cuno told us yesterday, he's traveling, going from Vegas last year to Edmonton. <laughs> Edmonton <laughs> in Alberta, I was thinking Canada. about that because like the finals broadcasts, right, on ABC, and I don't know if they're also on TNT or whatever, but you've got um, Dallas. I guess Dallas is a good city. Dallas yeah. is a good city. That's a, bit, that's, a, that's a big city, and Boston is as well. Um, but for hockey, like Sunrise, Florida, it's not exactly Miami Beach. Mm. Sunrise, Florida, and Edmonton, Alberta. They have gambling. They have strip clubs. They they got some stuff in there. They, they have gambling in Edmonton. Yeah, Canada does. You can go to Canada. And I, I don't think all over Canada. I think there's only oh, certain man. provinces. Yeah. Well, they have, have strip clubs. You're aware that Toronto. The Canadian city you've been to, Toronto is not all of Canada, right, Crowder? <laughs> How big's Canada? <laughs> Pretty big. Pretty big. <laughs> the Marlins do play tonight. The Rays beat them yesterday, nine to five. They'll get a uh, another go at them tonight. The uh, interstate battle between the Rays and the Marlins. I've never slept a night in Canada. I've been five times, and I always. Just go and then I drive back down, go back to Buffalo. I love Canada. I've been to Vancouver for a week. We loved it. Toronto for a week. We loved it. Um, one other spot, and I can't remember where it is. Montreal? No, I've never been to Montreal. Beautiful. Oh, maybe I was there for a day. Yeah. Calvary. Montreal. But I want to awesome, go to Quebec man. as well. Quebec City. Yeah. Gorgeous. 
Marco's texting me. Uh, Mark Ingram was the random player that I was thinking of that banged the drum. Hmm. Mark Ingram did it this uh, this playoffs. Why? What? Well, he, I, he I'm guessing that I, I'm guessing they couldn't find anybody. And he lives down here. Yeah, yeah. I mean, yeah. you listen, but that's how you might end up getting to do it. No, I mean, I, I'm not even throwing shade. I mean, Crowder was at the White House. Like, I, I don't think it would be Mark Ingram like. I mean, it's not Dan Marino, but I think Crowder's got some huh? significant national cachet. Doom, 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 doom. I got the beat down and all. You throw in a couple uh, tenders from Huey Magoo's or Andre Gadsden's down, man. What if it, what if you could get uh, you and Freddie T to bang the drum? Because he only got one here. paddle. We have two paddles or one paddle? Ah, he doesn't do much on the podcast. Uh, anyway, he'll just sit there and watch. <laughs> <laughs> it's a joke, Fred. <laughs> <laughs> Say something, Freddie T. First off, I would like to. <laughs> Fred, just yell, let's go, Panthers. <laughs> <laughs> well, where are the Panthers Man. going? First, let's let's rewind. You weren't exactly <laughs> uh, you weren't exactly uptown Dale when you got to MC Zach Thomas's uh retirement <laughs> ceremony at Hard Rock either. They put they put the handcuffs on me. They put the handcuffs on me. 